Hi everyone, welcome to my tutorial. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification bell for more upcoming videos. This time I will be showing you the solution to this problem. Conversion of units and analysis. Data are the following. Harvester with 1 meter cutting width. Travels 25 meter for 30 seconds. Harvest 200 kilograms in 50 seconds. Density of yields is 800 kilograms per cubic meter. Time loss is 15%. Works 7 hours per day. Tractor uses 12 liters per hour of fuel. And, fuel cost of 35 pesos per liter. What is required in this problem are the following. What is the actual capacity of the harvester in kilograms per minute? What is the speed of the harvester in kilometers per hour? What is the theoretical field capacity of the harvester in hectare per hour? How many hectare will this harvester process in one day? How many tons are harvested in one kilometer of harvester travel? What is the fuel consumption of the tractor in kilometers per liter of no-stop harvesting? What is the yield of the field in metric tons per hectare? What is the fuel cost per ton harvested? Assuming no time loss. What is the fuel cost per hectare? Assuming no time loss. Let us now proceed to our solution. First, we solve for the actual capacity of the harvester in kilograms per minute. We just simply convert seconds into minutes using the conversion factor 60 seconds is equal to 1 minute. We have now, 200 kg all over 50 seconds multiplied to 60 seconds all over 1 minute is 240 kg per minute. That is now the value for our actual capacity. Next that we are going to solve is the speed of the harvester in kilometers per hour. To solve for that, we will be using the conversion factor 1 km is equal to 1000 meter. Also, 3600 seconds is equal to 1 hour. We just multiply our given speed of 25 meter per 30 second to all of the conversion factors. The unit of meters and seconds will be cancelled. Now, we have a final answer of 3 kilometers per hour. Next, we are going to solve for the theoretical field capacity of the harvester in hectare per hour. We can use the formula, speed in kilometers per hour times within meters times conversion factor of 1 hectare is equal to 10,000 square meters. Or, we can also use, speed in kilometers per hour, times the width in meters all over 10. Any of these formulas can be used. We now have, 3 kilometers per hour multiplied to the conversion factor, 1000 meter is equal to 1 kilometer, multiplied to the width of 1 meter multiplied to the conversion factor of 1 hectare is equal to 10,000 square meters. We have now a final answer of 0.3 hectares per hour. Next, we will be solving the number of hectare that the harvester will process in one day. We will be using the formula, speed in kilometers per hour multiplied to within meters, multiplied to the conversion factor of 1 hectare is equal to 10,000 square meters, times the difference of the operating time and time loss. Substituting the values, we now have, 3 km per hour multiplied to the conversion factor, 1000 meter is equal to 1 km, multiplied to the width of 1 meter, multiplied to the conversion factor of 1 hectare is equal to 10,000 square meters, multiplied to the difference of operating time of 7 hours minus time loss of 7 hours multiplied to 15% or 0.15. We just get the product and we have a final answer of 1.785 hectares in one day. Next, we will be solving the number of tons harvested in one kilometer of harvester travel. We will be using the formula, speed in tons per hour multiplied to the harvest capacity in hour per kilometer. With these, we will be converting our speed in tons per hour using the conversion factor, 3600 seconds is equal to one hour, one ton is equal to 1000 kilograms. Also, we will be converting our harvest capacity in hour per kilometer using the conversion factor of 1 hour is equal to 3,600 seconds, also, 1,000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer. Using these conversion factors, we can now solve for our number of tons. We now have, 200 kg per 50 seconds, multiplied to 3,600 seconds all over 1 hour, multiplied to 1 ton all over 1,000 kg multiplied to 30 seconds per 25 meter, multiplied to 1 hour all over 3,600 seconds, multiplied to 1,000 meters all over 1 kilometer. 
We just get the product and we now have a final answer of 4.8 tons in 1 kilometer. Next, we will solve the fuel consumption of the tractor in kilometers per liter of no stop harvesting. We will be using the formula, speed in kilometers per hour multiplied to the number of liters consumed per hour. We first convert our speed in kilometers per hour using the conversion factor of 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter, and 3600 seconds is equal to 1 hour. We now have, 25 meters per 30 seconds multiplied to 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter, and 3600 seconds is equal to 1 hour, multiplied to the number of liters consumed per hour, which is 1 hour consumes 12 liters. We get the product and we have a final answer of 0.25 kilometers per liter. Next, we will be solving the yield of the field in metric tons per hectare. To solve for that, we will be using the formula, area times, the width, multiplied to total harvest in tons per kilometer. We have now our area as 10,000 square meters which is the same as 1 hectare multiplied to the conversion factor of 1 kilometer is equal to 1,000 meter, multiplied to the 1 meter cutting width, multiplied to the total harvest of 4.8 tons in 1 kilometer. We just get the product. We now have a final answer of 48 tons per hectare. Next, we will be solving for the value of the fuel cost per ton harvested assuming no time loss. We will use the formula, total harvest in tons per kilometer, multiplied to the speed in hours per kilometer, multiplied to the liters consumed in an hour, multiplied to the cost of fuel per liter. We now have, the total harvest in tons per kilometer of 1 kilometer all over 4.8 tons, multiplied to the speed in hours per kilometer of 30 seconds per 25 meter times the conversion factor of 1000 meter per 1 kilometer times the conversion factor of 1 hour per 3,600 seconds, multiplied to the liters consumed in an hour of 12 liters per hour, multiplied to the cost of fuel per liter of 35 pesos per liter. We just get the product to come up with a final answer of 29.1667 pesos per ton. Finally, we will be solving for the fuel cost per hectare, assuming no time loss. The formula to solve for that is, Area multiplied to the materials cutting width, multiplied to the total harvest in tons per kilometer, multiplied to the cost of fuel per liter. We just substitute all our values. We now have, our area of 10,000 square meters per 1 hectare, multiplied to materials cutting width of 1 meter per harvester, multiplied to the total harvest in tons per kilometer of 4.8 tons per kilometer multiplied to the conversion factor of 1 kilometer per 1000 meters, multiplied to the cost of fuel per ton of 29.1667 pesos per ton. We just get the product. Our final answer will be 1400 pesos per hectare. Thank you for watching. Before you exit, don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification bell for more of my upcoming videos.